marks a great a great discovery in history. Today we've found evidence evidence of a theory that we have not had any evidence to prove. That theory in question is the multiverse theory. And I've I've received a recording, a recording on my phone from a a person. A person that's odd. Quite odd. The recording was quite odd when I first saw it, but I've studied it. I've I've looked over it. Now here here we have a model. A model of a planet. Well, not really our planet. A planet that is in another universe, another place, another universe, one that we are not at. It may seem similar and simple to ours, very very similar, everything is the exact same, but in this recreation, something, something happened to their world, something very different than what has happened to ours. Our our earth is still standing, but theirs is on its last leg. There of being of power destroyed their world, opening them to the multiverse. Cosmic Entity killing their life. Hello, I'm a Dr. Charles Bentley. I am part of the narration you heard. I'm the voice of that. I'm also the head scientist of a government program that we have here in the good US of A. I am the head scientist, as I said, of that program. And so this video was made to kind of document what we found. So, through some um, satellites, we received a message uh, we thought was a bit disturbing. It was of a universe we believe was dying, based on how the, how the person talks. And so, all during the video, it's a person running around, and it was just odd. And so, during some, very, during the beginning, you can hear when he's in his universe, you can hear explosions. Very faint, but you can hear explosions. And it sort of scares us, because what if this happens to our universe? So we're making this for us and everyone else of the team. So that we can kind of examine the data and be able to use it to maybe stop it from happening to our universe. So, I'm going to show you this video. So, be prepared. We thought it was very interesting. Does anybody else hear that? They're like, they're like sound in the sky? Like... Or is that just me? It feels like I keep hearing this, like, explosion sound. It, c can you hear it? You guys, can, can you hear it? It's really weird, like, really loud. And I'm just, I'm just walking here on the side of the road. Right on the side of train tracks. And it's just, there's this weird sound I keep hearing. Like explosions. No, it's not the birds. I can, I can hear the birds, but like, it's something different. Something, something a lot weirder. It's just, it's just interesting. I think, it's really interesting. If you can hear, like, is it, can anybody else hear this? really strange, I think. Just, I've never heard anything 
Like what? Am I? Oh, I can't see anything. The universe is dying. But if you listen to me, I c you can fix it. Who are you? Where am I? What? Where are you? Why can't I see anything? Listen to me, and you can fix it. Just go out and do what I say. special and I don't is that so it looks like something is that ooh it's bright so oh, let's see let's try to get out of here <clears throat> freaking locked okay so Messy room. Maybe it's this. It's broken. No, that doesn't do anything. Um, piece of wrapping paper. <sighs> no. Hey. These no um toilet paper it's radio humidifier it's a calendar what's this no it's a echo thing so there's a bike here no presents this has to be it. What could it be? It could be this blanket. It could. What is this? What is this? They're blank. I feel like there's something here. Like a painting or something. Bunch of ties. One of these has to be it. He he said that. He, he said he would give me something. There'd be something. In here to save my universe. Lego brick? Is it a vase? Wait. Wait a minute. It's not July. It's March. Is this... Is this the thing? Is this it? I think this could this be it? Good. Now that you've found your first item, explain it to me. For you've been given the knowledge to explain it to me in Latin. You want me to explain what the word July means? Well, July is one of the months in the Roman calendar. It um, it, it was named after Julius Caesar, uh, and Julius is from the word meaning to pertain or to descend from Jove. Um, it also means to shine, or means sky in heaven. Is that good? Good. Where am I? Oh, there's the light. 
Okay, so what am I trying to find? What am I trying to find? So, no, nope. Anything unusual? Some talk for stuff? Nope, nothing really unusual. A bunch of chains. Got that. Some nunchucks. Um, safety glasses. Combat. GC Penny. This wood. Some scissors. Pliers. WD 40. Power vacuum. I don't know what that is. Um, that. And this. Nope. I don't think the sleds or anything. Uh, I can't reach that. It's all wheel over here. I can't reach that. I'll try that if I have to. Some records. No. A little baby swing. That's in here. Sponge. Box of batteries. Got that. Got that. Anything in here? Anything here? Um, there anything up here? There's a lantern. That's weird, there's some pennies. Big bank. Oh. There's a bird up here. Up there. No. What could this be? Blanket. Hmm. Um. What could this be? No, not that. Um. No. It's a mouse trap here. What could this be? I think this may be it. grab was a globe it uh, comes from Latin which in Latin it's globus which means a round mass sphere um, it also can be used for a crowd of typically men and uh, it's related to the word for uh, soil because a globe is the, the world and so the, since earth is um, in other languages means dirt so globe would also mean um, dirt or soil. So globe is just a big ball of dirt. Oh, whoa, what the heck? Where am I? In a parked car. What the heck? Just in a driveway. Okay, um, 
Where's this third thing? Is it here? There's just you know, hold on. No, not found that. I don't think. Where could, could it be in there? Where could this thing be? Um Could be the mirror. Um, yeah, I can't reach the golf box. Mm. The bag thing. Nothing in this one over here. Um, shoot. Can't lock the doors, dang. Um. Anything down here? No. Nope. How about here? No. Nothing in there. Nothing in there. Crap. And check the back. Okay. Uh, a cooler. Another cooler. What is this? Oh, I, I think I think this is it. You know what to do. Explain it to me. The word was picture, and the word picture comes from the Latin word pictura. This is a noun, and in Latin, and from Latin to English, it means painting. But picture is also related to the word pingere, which means to make pictures, to paint, or to embroider. These were used back in the old Roman days of Latin to show a visual or graphic representation of a person, a scene, or an object, or anything at all. Oh, oh no, I'm back here. Oh, shoot. Why am I back here? So, calendar's not here. Um, so it has to be a different item this time. Um, these towels. No, pants. Chair. Everything. Keeper. Blanket. Shoot, I got one more after this. Hey, the uh, person who's doing this to me, wherever you are, what? Why, why are you sending me back here? Do I have ideas or something? This blanket. Um, core. Ties. Nope. Oh. Could that be a, a tech? I fell. Nope, doesn't feel like it. Door is still locked. Batteries, face, lamp, shoebox. Uh, what could it be? Pillows? Tissue box. Whatever this thing is. What could this be? A lot of space. Look. Hmm. 
whatever this thing is, you know, this lamp. Wrapping paper. Hmm. I don't know what this could be. Hmm. What haven't I tried? Curtains, maybe? No. Um. Ceiling fan. Nope, that's not it. Could this be at this radio? Could it be this? Oh, I think I, I think this is it. You know what to do. Explain it to me. The word was radio, and radio comes from the Latin word. Radius, which means beam, and radio is like like electrical beams, and they all receive signals, like a beam of signals, to each other, and, and it's in a certain radius, which is where we get the word for radio. Oh, oh, oh. Where am I? Where am I? Why, why can't I see anything? Hello? Hello? Deep voice in the sky. Hello? Whoa. I don't hear anything. I don't see anything. It's pitch black in here. Can you say something, deep voice? Say something to me? What am I supposed to be looking for? What you are looking for is in front of you. I promise I did not forget to put this one down. What do you mean it's in front of me? What do you mean it's right he Oh, vacant, empty, the word vacant comes from the Latin word vacantem, which means empty or unoccupied. So, so the word's just an empty room. Oh, it's also related to vacare, which means be empty. But, uh, okay, I found the word. Do I get to go home now? D does my universe get saved? What, what happens here? I'm sorry to say this, but you can't go home. You don't have a home. Your universe is done. It's almost destroyed at this point. There's nothing you could do. Or there's nothing what what do you mean I can't save my universe? You're meaning to tell me you made me do all that for nothing? For for you So my universe is gonna die. You had me go on a wild goose chase for nothing. Huh. It was all my plan for the universe to die. I'm sorry. Uh -huh. You were right to do. I have to let it die. You're God, aren't you? I see. I'm 
Okay. So this is the end. See you.